I'm starting a t-shirt line, what's the best shirt to use? I can honestly say this is the number one question I get asked. To answer that, you have to consider what is most important to you about your brand. What people starting a t-shirt line usually care about the most is fit, feel, fashion, and how they can be decorated. So let's see if I can answer that number one question for you up next. Hey guys, it's Melissa with Shirtspace. When it comes to finding the best t-shirt to start a t-shirt line, what you'll first want to consider is your brand's aesthetic. If you feel like your brand is more about the design than the shirt, I would consider using the G500. Okay, what I'm referencing here is brands that tend to be about funny slogans or silly images. Personally, I wouldn't consider a brand like this to be a fashion forward brand. So a classic tubular tee might be your best bet. But I'm guessing that people watching this video are more interested in starting a fashion forward clothing brand. When it comes to a fashion forward clothing brand that appeals to all genders, I can definitely give some more recommendations. And again, we will wanna to touch on what matters most, fit, feel, and fashion. Let's start with fit. This is a big one. Everyone wants to look good and feel good. But playing to both genders can be hard. This is where manufacturers have stepped up to create the retail unisex tee. This slim fitting tee that caters to both genders will be a hit for sure. Next, let's touch on feel. A soft, comfortable tee will be something that your customers will not forget. So this is where fabric comes into play. There are three recommendations I would make on fabric. The first is cotton, the second is CVC, and the third is tri-blend. Let's talk 100% cotton. 100% cotton is a tried and true tee. Its only downfall is that it will shrink after its first wash. But if you provide your customers with the correct wash instructions to follow, they will be sure to fall in love. Next up is CVC. CVC stands for Cheap Value Cotton. This refers to the cotton poly ratio within the tee with a heavy percentage of cotton. These tees provide the softness of the cotton and the durability and texture of the polyester. Finally, we have our tri-blends. This is a blend of 50% poly, 25% cotton, and 25% rayon. A tri-blend is very similar to a CVC, but with an added feature. You have your softness of your cotton, your durability and texture of your polyester, but then with that rayon, you also get some added draping features. These fabrics all have a varying price point depending on where you'd like to be for your customer base. Okay, let's talk fashion. A huge trend in the fashion world right now is streetwear. So how does this apply to choosing a tee? Well, the unisex tee is one of the hottest things in the streetwear market right now. So you should definitely consider everything that I've touched on when choosing your fashion forward tee. But I know what you're thinking. WTF, I just wanted her to tell me the answer. Well, it's your lucky day. Here are my top picks for starting a t-shirt line. First, we have the Bella Canvas 3001C. This is a 4.2 ounce, 100% cotton retail fit. The shirt comes in a number of amazing colors and also has a tearaway label. And shh, it also comes in a CVC option. Next up, we have the N6210 by Next Level. This shirt is made up of 60% cotton and 40% polyester. It's a 4.3 ounce and comes with a tearaway label as an added bonus. Now for our tri-blends. First up, we have the TR401W, weighing in at a 3.7 ounce, making it a great lightweight option. Finally, we have my personal favorite. It's the 3413C by Bella Canvas. It's a 3.8 ounce retail fit with unisex sizing, side seams, and a tearaway label. Oh, and it's also pre-shrunk. What's not to love? Well, there you have it, guys. My thoughts on the best t-shirt to use when starting a fashion-forward t-shirt line. As always, thank you guys so much for stopping by and watching our videos. If you have a subject you'd like to see us cover, definitely let us know in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe, turn on your notifications, and have a great rest of your day. Thank you for sticking around with a video this long. I hope you're enjoying our educational videos. We have a lot more to come, but make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any. Oh, and come check out our Instagram. You won't be disappointed.